Hi, this is John and welcome to another video. Today I'm introducing Photoshop Elements 2019 and I'm excited to tell you in particular about the new photo collage feature which Adobe has reimagined and rebuilt from the ground up. Um, you can see here that I'm showing the new home screen and if I hover with my mouse you can see that it's possible to launch any of the programs directly from the from the home screen. I already have the organizer and editor open so I'm going to close this down and let's jump straight into the organizer and um, we can start uh, making our first collage. I've created um, one or two albums to begin with so I'm going to select one of these wedding albums um, where I have three photos ready to start. So I'm going to shift click to select those and then simply click on create photo collage. This will launch the editor interface and immediately um, the collage will start to be automatically built. And that's the first rendering of it. Let's click on the hand tool to get rid of all the interface and um, surroundings for the photos. As you can see, it's not completely perfect, but we can use the move tool to reposition photos. So this one needs to come down slightly into the frame. And there we have it. On the right, you can see we have all these different templates. And simply by um, double clicking on one, we can change the format between landscape, portrait, Facebook cover or Instagram. I'm going to change, I think, to um, the Instagram format for this one. So I'm going to just double click on this one. And as you can see, Photoshop Elements automatically updates the layout for the for the photos. And um, we have a very pleasant um, makeup ready for uploading to Instagram. I'm going to go bottom right onto the graphics panel. And you can see we have lots of choices here to change the background. So I'm going to look for um, a different uh, colour to replace the background with just by scrolling down this panel until I find something which I think is suitable to um, to blend with. I'm ideally looking for something um, with a sort of a purple colour to it. Maybe this one will do. So I'm going to double click on this purple background here which will blend in slightly with the flowers in the um, in the individual images and um, Photoshop Elements will change the background automatically. The ones with the blue corners need to be downloaded but if you've already used these before they will be instantly available and there we are, voila, it's updated straight away. We can save the project by clicking on the save button and that's the photo collage for you ready to um, go to Instagram. So I'm going to save this project. It's in PSC format. I'll call it um, Insta Wedding and then just simply click Save and then I can close the the project. And this will be saved automatically into the um, into the organizer interface. If I go to All Media and there it is. That's the, the one I've just made there. So one of the things I can do now is to go to File, Export as New, and I can choose to export a JPEG and um, decide which size I want. If I choose Custom, I can set the number of pixels that I need for um, Instagram and then simply click e Export and it will um, save a new copy um, into my Pictures folder. You can click the browse button if, you want, button if you want to save it onto the desktop or somewhere else. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to cancel it because I don't really need a copy. This is just for the benefit of the demonstration. But I think you get the idea. I'm going to show another example. And I have another album with five photos from the Venice Carnival. I'm going to press Control a to select all. That's Command a on the Mac. And then again, go to the menu and click Create Photo Collage. Again, the editor automatically opens and um, Elements will start to create this photo collage. This will take a little bit longer as there's 
more photos to be included and straight away it's made a pretty good job of centering all the images click on the hand tool just to clear everything out of the way and um, actually I'm quite happy with that as it is and um, could save it straight away let's just change to a um, a portrait format by double clicking on the layout on the right hand panel and elements should update it automatically and this is one of the beauties of this new new interface and there we have it a a, um, a, a, a vertical portrait um, photo we can also change the number of photos for example if we didn't want to use um, five photos we could actually right click on one and just simply say remove photos and removing that one photo elements will automatically update all the layouts for collages with four images and again we would need to do some readjusting here because we've changed the layout I think I should have done that on the last one when I turned it into Instagram but anyway you get the idea so there we have it automatically the templates have up updated and given us some more changes and it's the same if you want to right click and add photos it would it would do the same again and you can use any of the context menu to um, to change and customize your your collage i hope you like this and uh, i hope you found this um, video useful and um, leave comments below if you wish to but thank you for watching bye for now